Hey guys, Chandler here, back my channel, Alternate Journey, and today as I'm filming it, it's Friday, September 30th, so I am officially uh, 22 days post-op top surgery. Literally a day over three weeks. Everything's healing very good, I no longer have to wear the surgical binder anymore, and I can actually take off the surgical taped stuff that's been on my scar line. So, that's basically what today's video is, I guess. It's a three week post-op type thing, but also it's my scar reveal. <laughs> this is my chest three weeks post-op. Looking pretty good and everything. Um, so obviously I took off everything off camera and uh, cleaned the nipples and stuff. So right now what we're going to do is I'm going to wash my hands again and the they suggest put baby oil over top of this um, to help take it off much more easier. Oh my god wait this is childproof. Wait Oh wait, I surprised I got in that. It's sometimes hard to open things because like I can't apply that much pressure because like it really like tightens up your I never noticed like how much certain movements really do tighten your chest. It's crazy. Alright, I don't wanna put this on I don't want baby oil all over me though. Ugh. I don't wanna do this. I don't know how to do this. I guess yeah, my fingers is probably the most controlled way. Yeah. Okay, this isn't that actually hard. I don't know why I just like, totally was like, I don't know how to do this. I'm trying not to get any of my nipple, because I, I don't know. I mean, I guess I should shower after this anyways, because I'm going to have oil all over me. I guess I can talk about sensation right now, since I'm doing this. Um, It's definitely, oh, right here is painful. Right here on my ribs. And like on my side, but then again, this one is still very numb. That armpit, I think it's still actually a little bit bruised underneath my armpit here. Um, I don't know why, just my right side. Honestly, I really don't know why it's like that. But so we'll let that sit for a bit. Let me do the other side. Um, I can definitely feel all of this right here. It starts to get that numb factor, um, especially going in towards the nipple. Definitely all numb right here little still that pain sensation type thing right here. I think like the nerves are just trying to reconnect. So like touching right there. Same on this side too. Definitely more numb on my right side than my left. Um, underneath is pretty good. Oh, just, Yeah, towards the ribs and everything like that. Kind of painful and stuff, but I think I have good sensation right here. I feel anything. Just yeah. Still the numbness, like I said, during my two weeks. Scared, but very excited for this. Okay, okay, okay. Hi, Remy. Yeah, hi. <laughs> Sorry, babe, for what you have to clean up after me after this. <laughs> it's scary seeing dried up blood sometimes because you're like, oh no, please don't bleed again. I'm going so slow over here because it's like I can't, I really can't feel right there. So it's like it freaks me out because I'm like, what if something bad's gonna happen? Don't you, Remy? One side down, uh, the oil on this kind of pretty much dried, so I'm gonna re-oil this and do this side off camera because that took way too long, so I'll be right back. 
Alright guys, I'm back. This is my scars. I'm, yeah, I'm happy with them. They are pretty fucking straight. Like, as straight as you can right now and everything. Um, obviously, like, they're pretty nice and thin, too, obviously, right now. That's why I'm going to try to, like, not move as much as possible. Because that determines, one, like, on how your body heals and stuff like that. Um, my body's pretty good with scars, but then again, I had never had surgery, so I don't know how it does with, like, actual incision scars and stuff. Um, so, that'd be interesting to see. But also, like, your scars will widen out and basically be thicker if you move around a lot and everything like that. And, like, basically do out of your movement range, lifting your arms higher than you should and stuff, reaching for stuff. Um, basically don't go out of your way. If you start feeling the pinchy feeling and stuff like that, stop right there. Don't go out of your way to do, to reach for things. I know it's hard and everything like that. I'm a very independent person myself, so I understand. But, yeah, I'm very happy with healing process right now and I'm honestly seeing the actual scars of my chest of the top surgery I actually am liking my nipple placement more than what I originally did and everything not like I had too much of a problem with my nipple placement but for, for some reason I thought they were like too close together and stuff like that but then again that's what dysphoria does it will like trick your mind and stuff like that I've never seen my body this flat before with my chest and anything like even with binding like I, I could never have gotten this flat and i'm just like still so amazed by it it's it's crazy so but i'm happy with it it looks pretty cool so i still have like a slight bruising right here that's just chest hair right there and like you can see some type of bruising right here um Still has some dry blood and stuff like that right now. I did try to clean up as much as I can, but that's something that's just gradually over time will start to come off and stay with the stickiness still from the tape. I mean, the baby oil really did help with getting a lot of it out. But, um, yeah, just still no, like, scrubbing of your chest and stuff like that. You don't want to loosen anything that's not ready to actually come undone. These are dissolving stitches, like I mentioned before in other videos and stuff. And, yeah, still just... Making myself stay still, not move around too much, and just, yeah, um, keeping up with nipple care and stuff like that. Um, I will start scar care um, once I'm six weeks post-op. That's what my surgeon suggests and everything like that. So once that, once I get to that six-week mark, I'll uh, let you guys all know what type of scar routine I have chosen, or at least what is recommended by my surgeon. And see you guys in the next update video. <laughs> Bye.